Alright, what's happening, y'all? Welcome back to the channel. Me and Car Keys. So, I recently celebrated a birthday. So, for my birthday, my wife did something very amazing, very extraordinary. I love her for these types of things that she does. She took me to the Savoy Automotive Museum here in Georgia. The perfect gift for a car guy. Take him to a car museum. Perfect gift. We had an amazing time. We saw some collector cars, uh, some classic cars, some antiques. So, when we got there, the curator said to pick the car that's your favorite and let him know on the way out which one is your favorite. So I invite you to do the same thing. You're gonna see some a lot of cars in this video. Pick the one that's your favorite and leave it in the comments. I just wanna hear what people's opinion, opinions are. So you're gonna see my wife's favorite and you're gonna see my favorite as well. So uh, enjoy the video and I'd love to hear your thoughts on the way out. I've actually seen this at Georgia Tech events. Oh, yeah. mm -hmm. Not sure why. In the back seat. Cadillac. Your mom loves this one. Man, look how big this is though. Like seriously, <laughs> it's huge. Right in the back. Hmm. Yeah. <laughs> Cadillac. Nineteen. Oh. Nineteen sixty Cadillac. This is a Studebaker. What I like is this. This window goes all the way around. It's like one big round piece. Sorry. Studebaker. This is an Edsel Corsair. <laughs> it's a convertible, I didn't even realize that. With the mirrors. <laughs> oh, that green. I like stuff like this. Because these, these are weird. Little quirks about it. Fraser Manhattan. Yeah. I've never heard of this. So weird. I love his green though. That's cool. Kaiser Darren series. This is interesting. We think about the grill. <laughs> Everybody keeps saying the door slides. Oh, there we go. The door slides in. That is cool. It's a stick though. Wow, this roof. I don't know what material this is, but what is that? <laughs> Look at the dash. Look at the dash. I mean, the, uh, yeah, the dash. The seats. Like 
what it look like. Nineteen thirty-two. Second. How do you know it's yours? Six hundred ten dollars. Sixty-five horsepower. Is everything um manual? You say you do? I uh, got real wood in the back too. <laughs> Tailgate. <laughs> so this is my wife's favorite. Look at the clock. It has wood everywhere. Uh oh. The commercial. This is a Buick. <laughs> it's a Buick. <laughs> yep. Got the horns, got your fog lights. <laughs> 1932. Right. Look at the, even the, uh, all the designs on the wheels. The side view mirrors. <laughs> all right, so this is my wife's favorite. Was it 34, 1934? 32, 1932 Buick. What's that fuzzy thing back over there? It's a bench shade, I mean, a shade you pull down. No, in the window? That means the, right with the ball on it? Right. No, over there. Across. Oh, that, I have no idea what that is. I don't know what. Okay. Oh, that's a 1937 Cord Model 812 Beverly Sedan. It was the blueprint for the Batmobile, which makes a lot of sense because it looks like one in the front. Yeah, highway lights. So that is um, uh, the hood ornament. I like the paint too. Mm -hmm. I like the paint. Uh, mm -hmm. Is that a clock too? Exhaust. <laughs> This is a 16 cylinder. What is this? Marmon 16. This one has a front compartment here. And a back seat back here. It's its own windshield. And a trunk. Literal trunk. No, it's a Packard. Packard. It's a 1930 Duesenberg. Exhaust. <laughs> Got headers on it. <laughs> All the way down. Wow. Literal headers, y'all. Got the owner's initials there. That's cool. Look at the. Really? Are you serious? In 1930s, what? Yeah. And it's a, with no seatbelt. With no seatbelts. And a trunk, literally a trunk. Is that where the term trunk came from? Well, no, like a regular car has a trunk. Like, it's, did it come from them actually having a trunk on the back? Kind of makes sense. With the exhaust tips. <laughs> so we have a 41 Cadillac and a 
46 Lincoln. Go this way. You go ahead. Yeah. Okay, that's all. Damn time. Which probably goes up and down. Wow. <laughs> Is this where you put the gas? Is that the gas cap? Right <laughs> from the back. This is 35 Auburn 851 Speedster. Yeah, this is supercharged? Seriously? In 1935. Ooh. I think Fort Tucker model. There's three headlights. <laughs> paint is uh, <laughs> paint is on point. Dang y'all! Whoa. <laughs> okay. Yeah, plenty of space. I'm trying to get in the car, but now I'm trying to put my phone in the car, but whatever. <laughs> Hold on. <laughs> Got the <enough> pipes. <laughs> That's. It's supposed to be the wood collection. <laughs> it's a four row. Huh? Oh, it does have three rows. Look at that. <laughs> wow. So this one is a what is this fifty one Nash F light it says it introduced safety belts and reclining seats. Nash Hill Caps. Wow. Where is the wear seat belts? <laughs> Where are the seat belts? It says, it says, why is there a twin, uh, twin, blanket? it says twin bed blanket on. Yeah, it's the picture of the girl. So this is a 1940 Hudson Country Club, and this one has seatbelts in it. Unless they met, they put them in there afterwards, so they could drive it. They were driving it in 2020. They probably put seatbelts in so they could drive it. I'm playing the room back here. I like that. What was this again? This was a Kaiser Corsair. What was this? Corsair. Mm -hmm. I just like the color. <laughs> Cause I really like the color. 54 Studebaker Commander. I like the two-tone interior. 